Hello and welcome back to the next episode of our near replicant let's play series. Join me here just outside of our house where we need to head over here and talk with somebody and hopefully find a cure for Yona. Well, or at least hopefully she knows something about it. Oh, you're back. I was worried about you. I heard you went through the Eastern Gate and... Wait, is that a book? Yeah, it's... Now see here, I am Grimoire Vice and you will treat me with the proper respect. Wait, you're Grimoire Vice? Oh, that is so cool. Hold on, what? You know him? Of course. He's the white book I was just singing about. He's in your song? Yeah, the Song of the Ancients. It's an old tune that's been passed down through generations of villagers. It's in a forgotten language, so I doubt you could make much sense out of it. Do you know what it means? Well, it's not like I studied it or anything. But I can tell you bits and pieces. There's this terrible black book that shows up and starts spreading disease all over the place. But then this white book appears and saves the world and everyone's happy. You know how it goes. What is it? Uh, it's nothing. So how exactly does this white book save the world? It's just a song, yeah? I don't really know the details. Oh. Ah, don't be sad. Uh, look, why don't you go ask Popola? She's got a big brain, maybe she knows something. That's a good idea. Okay. Well, let's head up and see if we can find out anything more about this book. And maybe Popola knows a little bit more about Grimoire Vice as well. A white book. A black book. And a disease. Is something the matter? No, I was just thinking. All right, Popola, got a few questions for you. I heard about Yona. I... I don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. Well, maybe you can help. What do you know about the song the Devilo was singing? Wait, is that Grimoire Vice? You know Vice? Finally. Someone who appreciates quality when they see it. <laughs> yes, well, the Song of the Ancients. Let's see. When the great black book, Grimoire Noir, brings calamity upon the world. The white book, Grimoire Vice, will appear with his sealed verses. He will then use them to vanquish Grimoire Noir and purge the calamity he wrought. Or so the legend goes. What's a sealed verse? No such records remain, so I can't say for sure. But they seem to resemble some form of magic. That's it. Uh, what is? So the song says Grimoire Vice purchased the world of this calamity, right? And he does so using these sealed verses. Oh, and you believe the matter I infused in the shrine is one of these sealed verses? Exactly, Vice. With your power, we can cure Yona. Guys, don't get too excited. This is just some old legend. Hey, Vice was just some old legend yesterday, but here he is. And if he's real, the rest of it must be too. He can cure the Black Scrawl. I know he can. Do we know anything regarding the whereabouts of this Grimoire Noir? Sorry, but there's nothing about that in any of the records. All I can say for sure is that there are a number of sealed verses out there. Also, it appears the shades you fight and these verses are intrinsically linked. Then we'll go kill every shade we can find. No. That's far too dangerous. What an absurdly reckless plan. So I should just sit around and do nothing while Yona suffers? I don't think so. But, uh, well, it's clear I won't be able to talk you out of this, so... I've heard the Shades are gathering near a village called the Airy. It's past the bridge on the Northern Plains. They should be done with the repairs by now. I marked it on your map for you. Maybe you could find one of the sealed verses there. Okay. Once you arrive, be sure to speak to the village chief. He lives in the house up on the highest point in the area. Got it. Okay. 
Looks like we're heading back out then, but first... And be careful. Oh, well, I'm gonna definitely try to be. But first, I would like to run down to the town and buy those other maps. Just so I didn't forget about them. Some villagers may ask you to perform jobs for them to view any such requests. And choose the quest. Oh. Okay, so we can pick up side quests and stuff. Say, that song of the ancients is a rather catchy number. I can see why the bards kept it alive through the eons. Mm, yeah, yeah, it's a real toe tapper. Wait, do you even have toes? <laughs> kind of like the dialogue between the two of them. But first, I'm going to talk to this guy here. What? Hey, you. Hey there. Uh, is something wrong? You don't look too happy. Yeah, I'm in a bit of a pickle. Listen, you know about the chickens we keep in the village, right? Lately, their eggs have been disappearing. At first, I thought it was a thief, but now I think the hens are just hiding them. I guess I can't blame them, but the village really needs those eggs. I need you to find the hiding spots and bring me an egg. That work for you? Sure, we can do that. These chickens sound pretty smart. Yeah, they're clever little buggers. Anyway, just ask around. I bet someone in town will have an idea where to look. Okay, but first sure of all... Stock up on necessities before he yep, that's exactly what I want to do. I want to... Actually, that's so... What was it we got that we didn't need? The mutton. Let's get rid of the wool and the goat meat. Yeah. Alright, so that should give us enough to buy those three maps. Oh, there we go. Let's get all three of them. Didn't drop our money down too much. Yeah, definitely. So I wonder where these little chickens are. I didn't remember seeing them anywhere. Can I talk to you? Mutton is so expensive lately. I guess the sheep are getting kind of crazy, so people don't want to hunt them. Maybe. Uh, first, let's just head over here. We're not going to go out the gate, I didn't think. Ooh, who are you? Welcome. We've got a wonderful line of weapons to choose from. Oh, you have weapons? Wow. I don't think that they are any better than what we've already got. So, Thanks we're good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think we... Ah, here we go, chickens. But I don't think we need to buy any new... Um... <laughs> Look at them. Are they cute? Yeah, I know. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna fight you. I'll be good. They need the chickens. Alright, but let's get out of here for now. Oh, what's that? You can't carry any more. Not sure what I picked up, though. Hmm. Oh, well. Let's get out of here. Let's go do what Popola wants us to do. And check out this town. I just wanted to come down and grab those maps. Who are you? Oh, hello. What perfect timing. Can I ask you to go buy something for me? Uh, sure. Sure. What do you need? I need three tulip bulbs. They only sell them in Sea Friends, so it'll be a bit of a hike. Do you often get asked to handle such inane shopping trips? Apparently. I don't think these trips are inane. Yona and I survive on the wages I earn from these jobs. Everyone has it tough around here, but they still manage to give me work. Honestly, I'm grateful for it. Ah, <sighs> you're a sight for sore eyes. Could I ask you to handle some work for me? Sure, what's up? My children want to eat mutton every night, and I keep running out. And I certainly don't have time to hunt a bunch of sheep. Look, if you can get me ten pieces of mutton, I'll pay you higher than market value. How's that sound? That we can do. Sounds great. I'll be right back. That we can do on the way oh, where we're going. Me hunt down goats. <laughs> You're looking for chicken eggs? I saw one hidden in the shadows once. Uh, that really doesn't narrow it down. There are shadows everywhere. They're not goats. They're sheep. What is the difference? They're totally different. 
the white fluffy ones are sheep, and the scrawny hairy ones are goats. Oh, thank the gods you're here. We've got trouble. What kind of trouble? There's a wild boar in the northern plains who started attacking villagers. The victims all made it back, but who knows if we'll be so lucky next time. So you want me to go take care of it? Yes, and we'll be sure to pay you well. Sounds good to me. Oh, and a word of advice. Once you kill it, make sure you take a boar tusk. Let's just say it'll come in handy. People are different as well, yet you're all just called humans. Yeah, yeah. Hey, right, well, some of those we can actually do on our way through now. Do you have something to say, too? The chickens in this village like to lay their eggs in high places for some reason. Maybe that'll help you find where they're hidden. Hmm. Maybe we should check out the fountain by the library. Okay. The f oh, I saw that pig was coming for me. The fountain by the library. Let's do that real quick. I should so be out going towards that village, but I don't know. I'm kind of liking running around through here. I don't remember seeing a fountain up here. That oh, wait a minute, wrong fountain. The fountain would be down where uh, was her name, Devola, was sitting. Right? Yeah, there we go. How would the chickens get all the way over here, though? Hmm. Yeah, not seeing anything there. All right, well, get me out of here. I'll be here all day searching if I keep at it. Let's get out and go find what we need. Sheep hunting. There really <laughs> is no task too immodest for you. Apparently hey, not. It's harder than it sounds. They're really squirrely and they run away fast. So smite them with magic. Oh my. What is it? Whoa. Is it? No, you're right. If I use magic, I don't have to get close. Okay. Might I make another suggestion? What? Do not yell like a madman every time you come to a realization. <laughs> okay, we got a new word. You can enable... Words enable you to power up. Oh, ooh, nice. Okay, we'll check that out, out later. Well, oh, hey, you. I, wonder. I guess I won't use you for kindling after all. You really should treat omnipotent magical beings with more respect. <laughs> There's our sheep over there. Now I kind of wish I hadn't sold that mutton, but it's all good. I don't mind a little sheep shearing if I can hit them. Can I do magic on them? Oh, I can. Oh, that makes it a lot easier. Get a lot more of them all at one time. Where did my other one go? Uh, maybe I need to pick them up quickly. Okay, there's one. Yeah, they kind of disappear quick, so... We do want to be careful and make sure that we pick them up as soon as we kill them. So, one at a time. There we go. Nice. Let's take a look at that word thing. Is it down on him? Ah, here we go. Word edit. Ah. So what does that do for me? It has no effect. Hmm. Okay. Wait, is it this is the one that we're using, right? Still no effect. Okay. There we go. Doesn't matter. We'll uh we'll get it figured out eventually. What am I looking for here? Oh, across the the bridge. And that boar. We might need to um wait a little bit on that boar. <laughs> it might be stronger than uh Stronger Dark Blast. Oh, nice. It might be a little bit stronger than what we are able to take care of right now. Yeah, I see you got... Ooh, they're up there killing sheep, aren't they? I 
kind of really want to know. Oh, I see you. Let's see if we can get these sheep, get them cleared out, anything on you. Yeah, there we go. Let me work on decimating this little herd of sheep real quick. And then we'll continue on. Alright, well, now that the sheep population and the shades are a little bit thinner there on the plains, let's go ahead and head into the area where we need to be. Oh, cool. What's this over here? It appears to be deserted. Yeah, it does. Hmm. Looks like somebody's home or something. Alright. We'll maybe come back to that later. Maybe it's more important later in the story. Let's get through this little cave section here. Hmm, nice. More copper ore. Looks like we have a save spot up here. So maybe I should do that. Oh, good night. We gotta climb up all the way to there. Well, that's gonna be fun. Kind of a weird place to build a town. Good night. That's the one I need, huh? Okay, well, this is gonna take me a minute to figure out. Holy bobs. That is one complicated system. How do they get anything done in a timely manner? Well, I saw that. Alright, let me go ahead and drop a save real quick. Alright guys, let's get over here and start working our way up. Hopefully this doesn't take me too long to figure out. This is a weird place for a village. Mm. How are we supposed to reach the chief's house? Uh, very carefully, Grimoire Vice. Very carefully, indeed. Oh, wow. Okay, so there are shades here, too. Breakable boxes. Nice. Whoa, hey, 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 you. Come here. Absorbing blood tutorial. Ha. Ah, Jeez. Okay. Fair enough. Ah, there we go. So that's going to give me better attack power. Let's get that on as soon as we get rid of this guy. Jeez. And something about breakable boxes? Not yet. Okay. Hold on. Let's assign that real quick. No. Here we go. So weapons. And then this is the one we're using right? Hmm. Ah. See, it puts it on automatically. Okay. I suppose. I don't know. I need to look into that a little bit more. So we can't break any of those boxes. What about these? There we go. Uh, pumpkin seeds. Okay, I'm sure that'll come in handy for something. Can we go down there? Yeah, it looks like I can. Oh yeah, there's uh, an area down there. Let me bob back up here. Is there a ladder or anything that goes down? Hmm. I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is anyone even here? Why did I have to be born here of all places? I can't take it anymore. So it doesn't sound like they don't... Or they sound... They're, ah, geez, I can't English today. It sounds like they don't like living here. Ooh, nice. Level 5. Oh, there, I gotta say. 
Huh. Weird. Alright, let's get over here. At least we're getting closer to where we need to be. But yeah, it sounds like they really don't like being here. Alright, guys. What is your problem today? You're just being little things, huh? There we go. Man, that magic should have knocked him out. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Oh, hey, straggler. Alright, so it looks like I need to worm my way up this way. Can I get rid of some of these boxes? Yes, I can. Nice. Ah, here. We Whoa, I see. <laughs> no, I see, but I can't climb, apparently. There we go. I'll see you guys down there. No, you don't. There we go. A little shortcut down here. Get rid of these guys. Probably nothing but medicinal herbs in there. Whoa. Come on, bob up. There we go. Let's get rid of that guy. Maybe that'll help protect the village a little bit. Make them feel a little safer. Who knows. Alright, down this way. I see you hiding down there. Get down. Go down. Okay. Anything besides medicinal herbs here? Probably not. Do I need to go that way? Maybe. Oh, I see what I gotta do. Up here, and then smack that one. And then we can get up. There we go. What am I stuck on? I see you up there. Oh, you're gonna come down to me, huh? That's fine. I was gonna come up and meet you, but if you wanna be that way. Oh, come on, get up there. There you go. Can I... Yeah, I cannot get up that way, though. Alright. Looks like we need to head back and go up there. How would I get up there, though? Hmm. Well, let me take a minute and figure this one out. Ah, there we go. Get there. Keep going up, maybe? Try this way. Whoops. This is tr ouch, trickier than it seems. Maybe I need to go over here. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah, there's a bridge. Nice. So if we go out this way, just get us closer. Which we need to get over there. Yeah, I think it does. Whoa, hey. Man, this is extremely complicated. I don't know how anyone gets to anywhere here. If they even come out of their homes, would you guys back off? Here, have some words. I need to remember how to block. Oh, dude. Here, have some of that. There you go. Bass, huh? Alright. Looks like we need to head over this way and then up some more. Aw. So they... No! It hurts, Mom! It hurts! Whoop. Ouch, dude. There we go. Wow, we're picking up words left and right right now. So, what? I wonder what hurts. Alright. I cannot get over that way. Can I go down anywhere? I'm not seeing a down, though. I don't see any ladders or anything. Can I go up to go down? I mean, I can just jump down there. Whoa. Yeah, there we go. Probably not the way I was supposed to go. But I'm not seeing a... Oh, wait. This has put me back over at the beginning. What the heck? How did that get me all the way back over there after I went all the way through the other way? 
Well, this is going to be tricksy. Let me figure this one out. Oh, here we go. We were on the right path. I was just up above where I was at originally. Didn't have to go very far. Whoa, hey, people. What the heck? Another magic word. Nice. So that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. You guys can just go away. Thank you very much. Nice. Is that all of them? Yeah, that was all of them. Don't want to turn too quickly there. I might um, I'm looking fall for off. someone who knows about the Ouch. Versus. You just like her. Like kind of. Well, this appears to be a glorious waste of time. Come on, dude. Talk to me here. See if he'll at least come out and answer me. Whoa. This must be the chief's house. Who goes there? Uh, well, we're... Be calm, strangers. Wait, listen to... Enough. Leave this village at once and never return. What a pathetic bunch of rabble. So we came all that way for nothing? Enough. Leave this village at once and never return. What a path... Yeah, exactly. So now we gotta get all the way back to... Here, there are no powerful shades here. The sealed verses would never be found in such a place. Yeah. Let's go talk to Popola and figure out a new plan. Okay. So this is kind of a wasted trip coming all the way over here, it seems. Ah, there we go. I see those. Whoa. Let's go down here. Nice. Nice quick slide. I like that. Alright. And straight back out. So, not such a far trip. Then why did I have to go all the way over the other way? If I could have just got there that quickly. Interesting. A bit of a shortcut there, I think. I should probably save on my way back out, though. So, let's do that so we don't have to do any of this again. Alright, let's head back to Popola. See if she's got any other bright ideas. Maybe we can kill some more sheep on the way back. And gather more of that mutton that we need for our other quest. Still nobody over there. The heck is that? No, it's kind of glowing this time though. Let's go and look and see. Probably gonna get us in trouble. Nice flowers. Those are Luna Tears, legendary flowers of almost perfect beauty. You're kidding. Those are the ones I told Yona about. Hands off the flowers. Uh, Vice, why is that lady in her underwear? I fear we have greater issues to deal with. Mmm. Wait, is she a shade? We gotta fight her? Oh, yeah, we do. Holy heck. Okay. Son of a bitch. I, I can do that, though. Well, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, you stay back over there. Did we get her? That's all I had to do? Okay. Oh no, we got more. Whoa, hey, I, I hey, back up. Pages. The girl wields magic. Oh, dang, she was tricky. 
No, you don't. Oh, ho, 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 you are tricky, tricky. It's still going down pretty easy. We just gotta dodge you. And I don't think I can actually hit you, hit you with, um... There we go. Uh-oh. What did we do? Ah! We did that. Aren't you pretty? Oh, shoot. No, no, no. See if we can get in there and shoot him. Oh, no, 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 no. Ow, ow. Whoa. Oh. So she's mad at this thing, huh? Whoa. Yeah, I see it. Oh, there we go. No, no, no. Bob out. Bob out. Go up for a nice focus attack on him. There we go. That did some good damage. Whoa! No, you don't. Just something out. Yeah, I see that. These guys shades too. Oh man. Okay, let's get rid of these. Ow. Mind our health there. What in the bobs are these things? Could get that big. The scale of this one is like nothing you've encountered before. Radio guard. What are you doing, dude? Ouch. Die. Ow. Ow, ow. Die, die, die. Ow. Don't smack me like that. Whoa. That woman's mouth is as fierce as her sword was. Get him again. There we go. No, no, no. Ha ha. Ha ha. Oh, you got me on that one. Whoa. All right, so we're doing terrible here, but that's all good. There we go. Might need to heal, actually. I think we've almost got him, though. There we go. Get his head and get rid of him. There we go. Not too bad. Nice finishing move. Did she get squished? No. I told you to stay out of the way. Seems like this fight is between the two of them, and I think he just nailed her. Yeah, he did. Seemed to just make her matter, though. Doesn't seem like we killed it, we just drove it off. Get back here, you. The symbols are disappearing. Huh? Is she human? This one has been possessed by a shade. She exists as neither fully human nor other. I feel bad for treating her like one of those things. We have to help her. Dark hand magic. Okay. You're awake. You. I'm sorry we attacked you. We thought you were a shade. Oh, you're half right. Now get the hell out of here. Now see here. We made our apologies and came to your aid. The least you can do is grace us with your name. 
It's okay, Vice. She's probably just exhausted. My name's Kaine. Ah, the name we heard back in the village. Look, nothing good is gonna happen if you stick with me. So do like I said and go. Okay, so it doesn't seem like we can do anything oh, with her right now. Thing. That monster back there? It's mine. Stay the hell away from it. Okay. A half Fair enough. And a giant shame. She's kind of pretty, but she's really intense. <laughs> All right, so let's go and talk with Popola. We need a new plan. Right. All right, so Boar, no, no touch. <laughs> we tried it. It didn't turn out well. We'll come back a little bit later when we're stronger for him. Yeah. We're going to satisfy our souls with gathering some mutton. And let him live his little boar life up there for a little bit longer. Alright guys, well we've been out here for quite a while. And I've gone ahead and picked up all the mutton that we need. It wasn't quite that hard. Although the shades do seem to like to... Hey! Kill the sheep. <laughs> Seems like they have as much fun doing it as I do, so... Yeah. Just had to wait for a few of them to respawn. But now we can head back to the village, turn in that one sheep... Or the, the mutton quest, and then head up to Popola. And then I think we'll be... Hmm, I don't know. Where are we going to go next? I have no clue. Alright, ma'am. Was it you that wanted the mutton? Here's your mutton, ma'am. Oh, thank you. I swear these children of mine just love their mutton. If you ever find any more, I'll be happy to buy it. 1,500 gold. Nice. Nice. So, if we pick up any more, maybe sell it to her instead of to the merchant. I'm good with that if she wants to pay a little extra for it. Not a problem. Still no egg here, huh? I wonder if the kids know anything about it. Stop working and play with me for once. <laughs> so I guess they just want us to come play. No egg though. We'll keep looking. But let's get up here, talk to Popola, and see what she's got to say. A giant shade in the area? Yeah. It took all we had just to chase it off. I wish there was some way to strengthen my weapon. You know, there's a little shop at the entrance to the junk heap that might be able to help. If you bring them materials, they should be able to use them to enhance your weapons. Interesting. Guess I'll check it out. Oh, but it won't be free, you know. I figure you'll need around a thousand gold or so. A thousand gold? If you need money, Try visiting the tavern. That's usually where people go when they're looking to hire someone. Good advice. Thanks. Okay. So, she wants us to go get our weapon strength, in which, you know, I'm good for that. But first, to check out the tavern. So, let's go see if we can find the tavern down in town. Alright, guys. Well, let's see. Which one would be a tavern? Uh, maybe the one with the sign on it. This? Ah, yeah, here we go. Let's talk to the bartender, maybe. Hey, you got a moment? Because I've got some work for you. Oh, nice. If it's paid work, I'm all ears. <laughs> Fair enough. Listen, my grandmother is running low on medicine, and I need you to gather some ingredients. I need three medicinal herbs, three berries, and three royal ferns. You may have to leave the village to find some of it, though, so I hope it's not too much of a bother. Sure, we can do that. No problem. I'll be right back. And what about... Hey there. Devola, yeah. Wanna let a girl buy you a drink? Uh, I'm not old enough to drink, Devola. Also, isn't it morning? <laughs> when the sun never sets, what difference does it make? Ah, never mind. You'll understand when you get older. I do love this tavern, though. It's the nerve center of the whole village. Folks come here to relax, or swap stories, or even look for work. Come back whenever you have a free minute. Okay. Anything with you these guys? Easy today. 
I heard. Nah, they're just sitting there Is having there a drink. Really nothing that can cure the black scrawl. No medicine in the works of man can hope to stand against it. There has to be something out there. Perhaps a drug exists to temporarily ease the pain, but none can truly eradicate the disease. <sighs> We've got some new items. In so what have you got? Oh, you do. What was the grocery list that we Come needed to soon. do? Oh no, it was at the other town, wasn't it? I hold the key to saving your sister. You're hmm. right. We're gonna save Yona and cure the Black Scrawl. That's the spirit, lad. Hmm. Okay. So it looks like I'm gonna have to be heading out soon to go figure out how to strengthen our weapons. What is this? I can't. Whatever it is, I can't carry it. All right. Fair enough. Which way do I need to go to get? I need to go out the northern plains. Okay. So we're on the total wrong end of the map. In between episodes, I think I'll check out those side quests. See what all we actually need. For the one, I may actually have part of the ingredients already. Definitely have picked up berries that I know of. And a few of the other things. And I can always buy the medicinal herbs if I need to. Where is our house at? Over here. Alright guys, well I think this is where we're going to leave it for the day. In the next one we are going to go and see about getting our weapons a little bit stronger than what they are now. But for now, thank y'all so very much for joining me today. I've been Ball Girl. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I hope I'll see you in the next one.